Disclaimer, this video was made strictly for comedic slash artistic purposes. No offense at all is intended towards any individual featured in this video. Now don't forget to subscribe. I can't believe I got this on video. Do you really think you can walk out of wearing What? I would be so annoyed. Like, can't we just work out in peace? Would you date a bus driver? You. Would you date if a bus driver? If he owns the bus. If he owns no. it. If he owns the bus. See, that's a problem. It. That's a problem. I would date a bus driver mm. if he was, if he loved driving the bus, if he was a man of integrity, if he was good to his mama, if he treated me well, I would date a bus driver. But we think that it's another human being's responsibility to give us what we need instead of us building together. I can build with a bus driver. Mm. I'd have my little stash over on the side in my prenup, but I could build with a bus driver. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I think some of the criteria that we look for in the reality of today keeps us unhappy. Preach. What is wrong with building something together? Like the good old days. Who would have thought of that? My roommate doesn't like it when I talk bad about her boyfriend. So I would never do that. It makes her sad, whatever. But I think it was yesterday. I was like, dude, look who's my DMs, bro. This is crazy. And she was like, they're not even that cute. <laughs> I know you're not talking. Does anyone else's mom dress up for a high school baseball game? Hey, that car though, obviously a skit, but we could still get the message. Hey, money talks. So I've been talking to this girl, right? And then she texts me out of nowhere like, hey, you haven't texted me for a while. And I'm like, I've been busy, cause I have. And then she's like, okay, well, I just see I'm not a priority in your life. So I'm just gonna go ahead and leave. I'm like, um, okay. <laughs> so then I text her, okay. And then she's like, Wow, just like that? Yes. <laughs> yes, <laughs> what? Uh, you think I'm gonna beg for you? Bro, no, she's trying to train him. That laugh like, I got him. Somebody help him, <laughs> please. The most important thing to me now is being in touch with myself. I've basically been single for 27 years and over that time I've become super independent and happy and proud of the life I created for myself. I've done everything I wanted to do. I went to grad school, I traveled across the country, I moved to the city I wanted to move to, I got the dog that I wanted. But along the way, I built up a lot of walls and probably became a bit selfish and callous, so much so that I find it very difficult to allow someone to even have the opportunity to prove if they could make me happier than I make myself. Um, maybe I'm broken, but at least I'm happy. <laughs> Oh boy, it looks like the one with the best boxing ability might just have the power in the relationship. So it might just be time to hit the gym before it's too late. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, shit.
This is Phase Ed Music. Don't waste time worrying about why someone doesn't like you, why they're not responding, why they don't call you, why they don't text you, why this, why that, because they don't care. That's why. Okay. Sprinkle, sprinkle. I mean, can't they just be a little bit busy? Because some people might just have lives to live, you know, maybe. I believe you might need this. Thank you. Oh gosh, she's beautiful. Did you hear that? All right, so. Even this person right here had a glow up, a glow down. A glow up. Glow up. Yeah. Well, would you want to see what she looks like right now? Yep, let's do it. Right here. Boom. Hey there. Hi, Are I you? like your shirt. Nice hat. Thank you. Oh. Do you think she's attractive? attractiveness? Yes. Okay. Thank you. I like your earrings. Thank you. Okay, I think you're cute. Thank you. Thanks. Do you want to kiss on the cheek? Um, I'm good. <laughs> the composure is like, this might just be a trap. No thanks. Different because like I'm a vibe and like I have my own job, I have my own car, I can cook, I can clean, um, I know how to make chicken alfredo, that's my favorite dish to make. Also, I'm a Virgo, so you know, you know what that means. I am a freak. Not you being a great listener, period. It's giving support. I was 15 years old, my first girlfriend cheated on me. And I remember making a decision that nobody would ever cheat on me again. And the way I was going to do that is by being the biggest actor on earth. Uh, 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 uh. Are you two dating? <laughs> no, we're not dating. Like, we're just friends. Damn, she for real did that to you, bro? I thought y'all were dating this whole time. Leo, you no. talking to my girl? Yeah. Are you serious? Later. Are you serious? Are you yeah, serious? we're just friends. Look Dude, it's okay. It's okay, bro. Everybody comes and goes. Let's go, Leo. What? That cannot be real. Like, what kind of riz did we just witness? Just friends. I mean, just unbelievable. I'm doing a report on, on life, the finer things in life, and you're fine. So, can I just interview you for it? I'm gonna be late to come. And let me just grab your number real quick before you go. And then uh, we'll just do it later. Okay. All right. What's your name? Zaina. I'm Johnny. Okay, note to self. If he's not telling me I'm good enough and he's not grabbing my therna, then I shouldn't be thinking about things that I should enough. Okay? Okay. Okay. So, like, we are going to view all these, like, all these things. Okay. You understand? Camera, yash. Oh, no, camera, man. Hey, brother Bernard. Down bad. Might just want to stay focused. My number one example is as soon as he gets you, he stops giving you compliments or as soon as like he feels like, you know what I'm saying? He used to fiend for you and he used to like compliment you weekly, daily, every single two hours. And then he just stops. He's trying to humble you. And then you get to thinking like, why is he not trying to do like, why is he not telling me I'm pretty and I know I'm pretty? He's trying to humble you. Leave. Won't you be my okay. You could be. Yeah, man, we should I need a valentine. I need a valentine. I thought you was pretty cute. And I thought you was pretty cute. So we decided to come over here. I feel like, you know, this would be a solid group. You know, Valentine's Day coming up. We're going a double date. You guys are friends. Really We're friends. And I feel like we would just have a very a good time. Yeah. Well, can I get your number? Yeah. Of course. Hey, when the summer ends. I may be. I'm Jay. Solid group. Just 
sensation. Oh man, it's like too good to be true. Please tell me it is. Thanks for watching and don't forget to check out the links in the video description.